I have a rule that before I can buy something, I have to think of five ways to style it with items already in my closet. Let's see if I can style this blue button up five ways. Let me talk to you first about the difference between a loose fit and a slim fit. This is a loose fit. I don't tend to wear it unless I'm going to tuck my shirt in. It just isn't as polished, but if you do get that gap at the chest area, just use fashion tape to close it. This is a fitted or tailored button up. This is what I generally wear if I'm wearing my shirt untucked. The first way I'm going to style the blue button up is with the black ankle pants from the winter to spring transitional capsule wardrobe. It's just an elevated casual look and certainly paired with these loafers, very comfortable, almost as comfortable as my sneakers. And now we're going to take this look a step further and layer on top of it a camel blazer. I'm showing two blazers today, so I want to show them side by side and show you the difference. One is a camel color, one is a lighter beige color. Notice how the camel color really makes the blue color pop. And here we are doing an example of the three color rule which is a rule that says that no more than three colors should be in any outfit. We'll talk more about that in the future. Again, this is a very elevated, upscale, smart, casual look with the blue button-up shirt. For the next outfit, I'm swapping out the camel blazer for a beige trench coat. This is really a staple piece in any wardrobe in the months that wind up winter and lead to spring. Layering, while it's important to add warmth, it also adds depth, dimension, and interest to an outfit. I'm particularly fond of this trench coat because it has an A-line to it, which gives it a feminine touch to an otherwise masculine wardrobe piece. For the next outfit, I am going to style the blue button up with jeans. Hopefully you have a comfortable pair of jeans, a comfortable yet stylish pair of jeans in your wardrobe, and maybe you also have a blue button up because the number one rule around here is to shop your closet first. But a fitted button up is particularly important when wearing it with jeans because it draws the eye in, it keeps the button up shirt from overwhelming the wearer and just looks for, makes for a more tailored, streamlined look. Jeans, loafers, and blazers are one of my favorite outfit combinations. It's that elevated, smart, casual look where you're not quite formal, but you're not quite casual either. And here I've also added a hands tooth handbag to break up the color block look. Now let's see how the trench coat looks with the blue button up and jeans. Again, layers are incredibly important in the late winter months and spring months. And there are many days where I don't quite need a heavy winter coat, but a trench coat will suffice. And as I said before, I'm very fond of this one because of just a little bit of a feminine touch to it. Now let's pair the blue button up with a beige cardigan and some sneakers for a very casual look. 
Blue and beige is a very chic color combination, especially as we head into the spring months. The baby blue reminds me of baby bird eggs in spring, but when it's paired with the beige color, it sort of reminds me of the colors of the shore and the seashells and the ocean. Now let's pair the blue button up with the gray pants from the winter to spring capsule wardrobe. You may not be able to see it on the screen, but these gray pants actually have just a hint of blue to them. They're very pretty in person. And I think it, that hint of blue pairs nicely with the blue button up. But let's take it a step further and put the beige blazer over the blue button up with the gray pants. Again, three color rule here, beige, blue, and gray. And this very much reminds me of the colors of the, she the seashore, those three together. Pairing the blue button up with the beige pants provides another example of this very chic color combination, the baby blue and the light beige. Here I'm adding heels because these are longer pants, it just gives me plenty of length, makes my legs look longer. And to take the outfit a step further, there is a matching beige blazer that goes with these pants for a professional, polished, and pulled together look. In general, I try to fill my wardrobe with classic pieces. Pieces that stand the test of time and won't go out of style year after year. But this satin slip skirt trend is a trend that I'm really on board with. It's so elegant, so feminine. I just love it and very versatile. So here I have the slip skirt, the button down, and then over top of that, I have styled this striped cardigan for a very French woman feel. And finally, let's pair this outfit with the A-line trench coat. This is a good look if you're headed out shopping or if you're going to lunch, the shoes are very comfortable. As always, shop your closet first. See what you already have in your existing wardrobe to pair with a blue button up. You might actually have a tailored blue button up already in your closet. Until we meet again, my friends.